Hi guys, welcome to 5mantra.com. This is Kalyan, the faculty of aptitude and we are going to discuss in this video, we are going to discuss about some different problem in menstruation which is not actually difficult but we need to just classify the figure and separate the, separate the partitions and then we can find out the area. That's it. What it is? Let us see. Just your question is to find out uh, shaded region means red colored shaded. This this means this one. How to do this? See guys, uh, here actually the uh, actually this problem is not at all difficult. But uh, if you look at this problem as it is given, then it will be very difficult. Why? Because actually this shape is nowhere there in the uh, menstruation basics. What we have, uh, what the basics we have taught in our uh, uh, menstruation basics, like from like from triangles or circles or quadrilaterals or hexagons, from all this, if you consider, if you just uh, try to sort it out, no one shape will be like this directly as it is given. So how to do this? It's a very simple thing, guys. Here we just have to uh, consider this one. Okay, here. Uh, like uh, for example this is a uh, uh, this is a shape okay this is a shape which is not directly defined let us do partitions and then we do the calculation okay for that sake what I am going to do is just see and observe now somehow is it looking like this or not it's so simple now now, I for our convenience, I want to make them separate. Like how? For example, and one more thing I need to tell you here is, the measurements are this one is 10. This one is 10 in the sense, this is 10, this is 10 and this is 10. Means this lined portion. Okay. When this is 10, so this is 10. Okay. And this also would be 10. This also would be 10 and this also would be 10. And this part is 7. This point, this part is 3.5. That you need to consider. Right? Now, let us do the partitions for this. So, is this correct or not? Guys, you might have observed this or not. Simple. Now, let us see here. Is this a rectangle or not? And is this a rectangle or not? Now, let us write down the measurements according to the given figure also. Now, just see. I am showing you these figures like this just because here this one as it is, if you do the given problem with the given diagram, it's quite impossible. Then how to do this problem? Simple. You need to you need to divide. You need to separate the given diagram into different partitions, and observe the partitions which are in the primary shapes. Primary shapes which are given in the details of menstruation in the basics. Now, is this a rectangle or not? So these two are rectangles only. Clear? Now, and what about the measurements of these rectangles? Let us observe in the given diagram of the problem. Just see. Now, here what we have given, I'll explain you. Here this is 10 centimeter or not, guys? So, is this length 10 centimeter or not? So, the length which we have separated here, this is 10 centimeters. Getting my point or not? So, this is what? 10 centimeters. So, this length would be your 10 centimeters. Clear? Now, in each case, for example, okay, that means this, if this is 10, this also would be 10. Is that right or not? So, the same thing will be happen to this also. Means, these two rectangles are equal in their dimensions or not. They are having the same dimensions or not. For example, this is 10. This also would be 10. This also would be 10. This also would be 10. Means, this is the rectangular part 
and this is a rectangular part that means this length this length this length this length this length all are tens that means this one is 10 this one is also 10 this one is also 10 and now coming to width region is given so that means width of this entire circular ring as well as width of this uh, rectangular part this width is how much 3.5 or not so here also this would be how much 3.5 or not okay this also would be 3.5 getting my point or not and what does is it represent in the given diagram this represents the breadth of the rectangle or not so here this would be breadth of the rectangle which is which is how much guys 3.5 or not so breadth of the rectangle is given as 3.5 so this is also 3.5 okay 3.5 centimeters right so let us see guys this is 3 0.5 so here about these two pieces once again showing you here this piece and this piece these two are equal in their areas because their dimensions are same how dimensions are same this is 10 this is 10 this is 10 this is 10 means lengths of the each of the rectangle are 10 from the given figure and breadths of the each rectangle from the given figure are like this this is a 3.5 so 3.5 we have the we have the dimensions of these two figures is that right or not so we can find out the area of this one now attachment of these two okay attachment of the these two uh, i mean this two means this part this part and this part are attached together to form what circular ring or not certainly circular ring okay now if you take uh, now let us see uh, guys here uh, let me show you something that here this is a uh, i mean breadth of rectangular part as well as same thing is acting as what width of the circular ring also or not so this is a width of circular ring also okay breadth of each rectangular portion is equal to width of this circular ring also or not if you analyze this figure what can be obtained just see here okay just look at this uh, so this width we have given okay here this width would be how much 3.5 or not 3.5 next so this let, have a look at this okay now again just um, okay see this now what this i mean once again i'm telling you this width i mean this breadth of the each rectangle is coinciding with what okay width of the circular ring so now this would be your circular ring width or not how much is that 3.5 centimeters now as we have given this part of length this length is how much given it is this length is given as how much seven centimeters or not means this part or not this part in the sense this part only no uh, in this circular in this circular ring okay this is a diameter of inner circle or not if you consider this as an inner circle okay this is a diameter of inner circle is that right or not and that would be given as seven centimeters that is given as how much seven centimeters now then radius would be your 3.5 again or not 3.5 when diameter of inner circle is that right or not here here this is seven 3.5 this is 3.5 means this is inner circle radius diameter or not when this is inner circle diameter 7 centimeters at diameter then inner circle radius would be how much 3.5 or not now if you do analyze see you need so what is your target you need to find the areas of this rectangle and this rectangle and this circular ring that is your final target for finding this we need, we need to have the length and breadth already we had it 
Now, for finding this circular ring, this circular ring from the basics of mensuration again. Okay, what is the circular ring? Tell me. Now, look at this one. Is it representing a circular ring or not? So, when it is representing a circular ring, we have given this length as how much? Okay, three, uh, 7 or not? See, here is this 7 or not? This length is only this one, no? Means diameter of inner circle is 7. When diameter of inner circle is 7, its radius would be half of the 7. That would be 3.5. 3.5. Means inner circle radius. Let us represent with small r. Small r is how much? 3.5. And now tell me, is it a capital R or not? Means entire this part. Now coming to this part is given again how much? Width of this. Width of this is how much? 3.5 only no. When this is 3.5, means this entire length would be 3.5. Okay. This entire length will be 3.5. Means if you take this total distance, this is a capital R or not? For which the value is small r value is this one. This is width of the circular ring. And adding these two, we get capital R or not? Okay, capital R. How much is the value of that? Here, this is 3.5 and this is 3.5. Means added together to get capital radius. That means this is 7 centimeters or not? So, we have inner circle radius is 3.5 centimeters and outer circle radius is 7 centimeters. Clear for you guys? Outer circle radius is 7 centimeters and inner circle radius is 3.5 centimeters. Now, we need to find out the area of circular ring. See guys, I am not explaining you here circular ring, how to get the circular ring area. That circular ring area will come in the basics of this menstruation. Now, just we use the formula to find out circular ring. So, circular ring means this one. Okay, one second, just I will show you. If this is a circle, with the same center, if you draw another circle, means like this, like this. Okay, then area between them, area between them is known as circular ring. Where capital R is a radius, where capital R is a radius of outer circle and small r is the radius of inner circle, then what is a area? And this, let this be width, width of the path. Okay. Let me show you here, like a... This is a capital R and this is a small r. Okay. And this is a width or not? Width. Okay. Now tell me, what is the area? Pi into capital R plus small r into capital R minus small r. So, this is the area of this ring. Ring means area enclosed between this circle and this circle. That means this portion, black colored portion. Get it? So, just see. Now, look at this guys. What is our final target? You need to find out this entire black colored portion. Why? Because we have separated them into pieces. Now, we need to do the find out the area of this, this and this. So, first of all, these two are same in the sizes. So, it is sufficient to find out the area of one of them and make it, uh, make it two times, means in multiplied by two, some of the areas of these two. Okay, then each one is in the shape of rectangle. So, uh, first shared area for this area would be how much? Length times of breadth, length into breadth. Length is given how much? 10. Breadth is given how much? 3.5. So, 10 into 3.5 would be how much? 35. So, 35 centimeter square is the area of each one piece. Now, how many such a pieces are there? Two pieces or not? Okay, two pieces. So, uh, area of the rectangular portions. Total area of the rect rectangular portions. I'll, I'll show you here. Total area. So, total area of rectangular portions is how much? Each one 35, that, like that two are there, 35 two is how much? 70. So what is that area of the, these two rectangles? 70 centimeters square. Now let us find out the area of this circular ring and as we said the area of circular ring is, okay, 
पाई इंटू कैपिटल आर प्लस स्मॉल आर इंटू कैपिटल आर माइनस स्मॉल आर एज वी सेट कैपिटल आर वैल्यू इज सेवन एंड स्मॉल आर वैल्यू इज थ्री पॉइंट फाइव नाउ टेल मी पाई आई पुट डायरेक्ट वैल्यू सीयर ट्वेंटी टू बाई सेवन कैपिटल आर प्लस स्मॉल आर कैपिटल आर इज हाउ मच गैस सेवन प्लस स्मॉल आर थ्री पॉइंट फाइव सेवन प्लस थ्री पॉइंट फाइव इंटू सेवन माइनस थ्री पॉइंट फाइव इज इंट इट सेवन माइनस थ्री पॉइंट फाइव सो सेवन प्लस थ्री पॉइंट सी लेट एस डू एनालाइज दिस ट्वेंटी टू बाय सेवन ओके इंटू सेवन प्लस थ्री पॉइंट फाइव इज योर टेन पॉइंट फाइव इंटू सेवन माइनस थ्री पॉइंट फाइव वुड बी थ्री पॉइंट फाइव अगेन थ्री पॉइंट फाइव इज हाफ ऑफ सेवन और नॉट इफ यू टेक थ्री पॉइंट फाइव कट टू टाइम्स इन दस और नॉट थ्री पॉइंट फाइव टू आर सेवन टू लेवन आर दिस सो वॉट इज लेफ्ट अगेन टेल मी हियर वन सेकेंड आई एम टेलिंग यू हियर थ्री पॉइंट फाइव टू आर सेवन Uh, and two elevens are. So what is the left? Now still left. Eleven and ten point five in numerator part. Nothing is there in denominator. So let us see. So what is your answer then? Eleven into ten point five. What is eleven into ten point five? Multiplying with eleven, oh, I think you know about this. Finally, we get one one double five. As we have decimal after one one digit, we can keep it like this. So finally, what is the area of this black colored circular ring? Tell me, guys. Black colored circular ring is one fifteen point five centimeter square, and uh, area of the each rectangle is thirty five, and two rectangles is how much? Seventy. So let me show you here. Just tell me, guys. Here, what we have to do? so finally guys here sum of the areas of these two rectangles area of rectangles is how much boys here 70 cm square okay and area of this circular ring how much is that uh, circular ring 115.5 cm square got it or not now in order to get this to entire red colored part we need to add this area plus this area plus this entire this black colored circular ring okay add them all what do we get 70 plus 115.5 what is this 180.185.5 or not 185.5 cm square So, what is your answer? One eighty-five point five centimeter square is your resultant area of this entire figure. So, out of the given options, which is the correct option? Out of the given options, which is correct option? Your A. So, guys, in this type of problems, okay, please do consider. I'm telling you, guys, that please don't get hurry while doing these problems. This problem you can't do directly. we have to separate the diagrams and we need to do analyze separately this problem is somehow different than previous problems okay hope you guys would have enjoyed this one and we'll come up with uh, this kind of uh, this type of difficult cases once again in the uh, uh, upcoming videos okay please do subscribe our channel to get further updates thank you very much